Hey guys, it's JackSpar123 and we are on the Gaming Evolved Scorched Earth server. In today's episode, we're going to be breeding up a vulture and a camel -saurus. So yeah, let's get right into the video by first of all hatching this baby vulture. Now I know I don't have food, so let's quickly before we kill a vulture. Let's get some spoiled meat and let's get ready to feed this guy. I'm going to need a lot more spoiled meat to say the least, but it's what's going to be required. And I dropped that. Is this thing too cold? Fire. Incubating. Perfect. Let's get him. Oh. Level 109. Not bad, not bad at all. He's a baby. We've got a baby vulture. Let's name him Harold. Harold. J has. I don't care if it's female, but it's male. Anyway, so I'll speed up the video while I breed this guy up and imprint him. Enjoy the montage thingy, maboop, whatever you want to call it.
Okay, he finished doing whatever it was, and he's all done. He's strong. He's he's not a bad bird. I wish he didn't want the camel sore kibble. But what can you do? And now you'll also see in the title there is another dinosaur that we are going to be getting. It is a camel sore. Is this a camel sore? Yes, camel sore. Light fire. Incubating. Yay! We are getting a camel sore now. Mega cow and cow. He's going to be really weak though. Like next gen weak. But whatever. What can you do? Am I right? The big thing with the Fultress is it wouldn't have gotten much stronger if I imprinted it. It wouldn't have the like 30% damage increase or anything. The most it would do is get a little bit more HP. I did go and gather some berries. A lot of berries. I don't care for silica pearls. Or rock. Oh gosh, it's covering the egg. So let's get this camel sore up and I'll be back when he's all done. Like I'll just speed up the whole video. Speed it all up. I don't care. I'll speed up the video.
Okay, guys, we're back. He's almost grown up, and, uh, yeah, that's going to be good. There we go. See, he grew up. We have Battle Cow. The fastest and most powerful cow on the server. I'm kidding. I don't think it's the most powerful. But it might be a good cow. Real good cow. Lots of weight. Now, he has 294 damage. So, I want to test out to see how much that is. Oh gosh, that's a lot of damage. That's really good. That is really good. Lots of damage means lots of power, and lots of power means lots of killing. So what I think we need to increase on him is HP and stamina. Because this guy is horrible on both. Like, really, really bad. So like, look at that HP. 819. That's not even going to be enough to survive like a saber. He'll be able to kill the saber nonetheless. But he's not going to have enough HP to fight another thing right after. Which will likely happen on this map. So I'm going to just kind of kill stuff here. In the next episode I plan on taming another thorn dragon so we can get a thorn dragon baby. Post in the comments what you think of that video. And if you enjoyed please comment down below what was your favorite part. And I'll see you all in the next episode. Bye.